In this lesson, we're going to learn more about using video clips with the all new ProShow web app. To begin, adding a video clip to a show is exactly the same as adding a photo. When building a show, tap the Add button at the bottom of the screen, then select Photos and Videos. Then browse through your device or online services to find the video you'd like to use, and tap the Add button up here at the top. Now for best performance, it's highly recommended that you use Wi-Fi when adding video clips to your shows. Now once added, video clips will have this movie icon and the length of the video clip right here on the thumbnail. Now ProShow treats video and photos the exact same way. So if I want to move this video clip to the beginning of my show, I'll simply tap and hold, then move it right here. Now let's tap and select the video and take a look at some of the editing options that are available in the app. The first editing options you'll see are the effect and transition options. We'll cover these in more detail in another tutorial, but this is where you'll go if you want to apply custom effects to your video clips. Jumping down to the very bottom, we have some video only editing options. The first is the mute option. If your video clip has sound, simply tap this toggle switch to turn the video sound off or on. Next, we have the trim option. Tapping this allows you to change the length of your video clip. Using the preview at the top, slowly swipe through the video until you find the place where you want the clip to begin. Using the preview at the bottom, swipe through the video until you find the place you'd like the clip to end. Now as you swipe, the starting and ending times will update. And right here in the middle, you'll also see the overall new duration of the trimmed video. The trim feature doesn't permanently edit your clip. We're simply telling the app which part of the video to use in the show. You can always go back and change the trim times later. Now once the start and end times are set, Tap the Apply button at the top to apply the trim and return to the Edit screen. There's one more option available on the Edit screen, the Text option. This allows you to overlay text directly onto your video. Tap here where it says Caption, add some simple text, then tap Apply. Now at the top of the screen, Tap back to return to the Edit Show screen. Let's take one more look at the slide list. Again, right away we can tell this is a video because of the video icon. We can also see the new trimmed length of this clip, and we now see this T icon that tells us we've added a text caption to this slide. So by moving the video to the beginning of the show, trimming it down a little bit, and adding a caption to it, we should end up with a really nice video title slide for this show. Let's build it and check out the results. As you can see, working with videos is very easy and can really make an impact in your shows. Give it a try the next time you make a show with the ProShow web app. Thanks for watching, and be sure to visit our blog and check out our YouTube channel for even more helpful tips.